are less. less conservative. Less is more. What? Well, yes. 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 Less conservative. No, hide those titties. I'm so tired of seeing naked women. To, and, I mean, to I'm not stop out here naked. Like, it is too I, I you pretty much, I mean, look, look, think about it. So many guys, like, girls are pretty much naked on Instagram automatically. Like, I'll be talking to a girl. That's why I stopped mm. dating. Like, I was talking to a girl, like, yeah, blah, blah. I look at her Instagram, and she's just sticking her ass out on the beach, like, bending over. Like, this pose now, girls, like, gonna grab their knees and just bend over. <laughs> why am I gonna go and try to get Sexy to know you? I mean, I can already see though. you naked on the gram in five seconds. You gave point, it away you for free. You should be able to discern that before you even see the IG. Like, you kind of know. No, you, you see girls, like, even her, like, trench coat, you could still, like, look at her gram and then no, see her naked I automatically, I swear. There's but a time and place for everything. everything. Okay. Because you're not gonna go to the beach dressed up in a turtleneck. But then the again, point, but you don't need to post that. The point is, nowadays, you see on Instagram for free what you used to have to work for. Oh, yeah. Back in the day, we'd be like, yo, look at that, she's in a bikini, and now it's just, she's doing it automatically for Mark Zuckerberg. So I think that as much as we want to make it seem like oh women were conservative back then, like no shade. Like a lot of our aunties and like shit were like like bro, they were like like promiscuous, bro. I mean, they were, but I'm saying social wild. media has desensitized the male brain to a lot of girls. That. We can't yeah. think that it shadowed it. I, I'm not saying it's more conservative. I think everything that's here now been it before we even knew it before the internet. Nah, showing your no. ankles was like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. They they showed their titties back, back yeah. then, bro. That's a myth, bro. They showed their titties back then for sure. They I'm did, sorry. but not for everyone in public to be seen at any moment. For what era was this? They didn't show it to the whole entire world. There was no way like mm -hmm. no man at that time Facts. would be with a woman that's, that's respectful right, yeah. that's showing her titties like that was like something so, so crazy the naked bitches are so the popular just ones became too. A, became i mean a think they about did. it yeah. even like when when like sorry whorehouses right <laughs> they were secret and the women there go with their titties out but they were secret like nobody was supposed to know where they were why cool. if when it was, was that natural yeah, whatever. Just Probably curious. Like in the 20s? 1920s? The 20s? Yeah, what 100%. Are we? 19, what are we? 2024. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me give you an example. I said 19. Let me explain it. Let me explain it in sexy red language. Please help me understand, Let me explain it in sexy red language. And I don't, language. no, but no, don't explain it in sexy red, because I, I don't, I'm not you don't a don't sexy red You don't know what year it is, so let, let me have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 10 years ago, or 11 years ago, Anaconda came out, the Nicki Minaj video, remember? My yeah. Anaconda, uh, <laughs> that was the first video, that was the most provocative video at the time. There was twerking, they were like sucking bananas, all the girls in there had their asses out there. in soft porn at the time. Mm -hmm. That was mm -hmm. incredible. So Lil' Kim, oh, having, look, what about Lil' Kim? Let me explain. What about, what about Eve? She was a what big a, bopper. What, what's about that, bro? So, <laughs> let me explain. It doesn't, but it, so that means that it was here, right? What about okay. Trina? I didn't finish what about Trina? Trina? What about Thank Trina? You. Okay. There's always been prostitution. Okay. First, there's always been prostitution, sure. Okay. Okay. My point is, yeah. it just was wasn't glamorized and exactly. popularized. Let me explain it right. <laughs> that was the most provocative video at the time, right? Today, that's every single video. That used that was really controversial at the time. It was banned on YouTube. People were like, whoa, like guys used to jack off to that video. Now every single hip hop video has to be that. Every bro, single that's female bullshit, rapper. Bro. You got ludicrous. I wanna let 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 lick you from your head to your toes. Like I'm not gonna let the you. The music video right wasn't depicted like that. But the imagery, yeah, uh, bro. The point is that's every hat, bro. <laughs> and you, you bring up Lil' Kim as an example. Lil' Kim was a rapper, right? She actually had some bars, correct? Hell yeah. Every female rapper now is a stripper. They don't have any bars. They don't even have to have uh, the lyrical uh, aspect. Cardi B. Cardi B has a bar, bro. I would say that's bullshit, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, <laughs> I, come, I come from rappers, bro. I come from sexy, bro. Chicago. I know. Like, I, I speak, your, I speak I come language. from there, bro. So it's like, bro. And I'm sexy red is St. Louis, bro. So I do want to add emphasis to that, bro. So it's like, sexy red isn't even my favorite artist. I'm so I don't understand. Finally, someone that says, bro, more red, than me. Yeah. <laughs> sexy red right, talk too much. My point is, okay, you bring up Lil' Kim, but at least she had to rap. Uh -huh. Now, for a female rapper to succeed, she just needed to. Get yeah. naked. Yeah. It's not a, a, a mm. at least. Like I don't. I hate to contradict. Like right, the, I hate the at least. Like it's not an at least, bro. It's like were they or were they not? They were. They've been promiscuous since the beginning of times. You guys, internet has just become big now. So you guys are now eye opening. Now it's an eye open experience, right? Because more women are like that, bro. They've been like this. Yeah, bro. But sure, they've been like that. The whole point, and I agree with it's you. About money. The whole point is they've that like this, bro. sweaters are so attractive now. <laughs> trench coats because we're getting desensitized to it. Yes, there were promiscuous women, but now it's yeah. normalized to show yeah. it on social okay, media. Okay, now I can agree with that. So and now anyone can, can just that. sign up from their bedroom to to be that way. Oh, exactly. <laughs> so just so put on a sweater. That's it. Yeah. Cover up. I'm it's more attractive. Sweaters. We've seen too many titties. 
I would like I now want to see a girl like you look like you're gonna flash somebody on the subway. That's what you're dressed like. <laughs> that right there <laughs> is such a turn on. Like what do you have under there? You know? What are you gonna are you gonna open it up and there's like I don't even know what what, what those are they thing? I don't know. Yeah, it's the mystery. It's the mystery. I don't know if you're gonna harass me or not. You know, it's it, it's great. I, I want it, I want the potential to be visually harassed. I want to be surprised. I want to open it up like a present on Christmas. Now all the presents are just given automatically. There's no that, wrapping on it. I get yeah. That. Cover and up your gifts because they're yeah. presents from God. Exactly. Well said. Oh, you said you became celibate how long ago? <laughs> Two weeks ago. What the fuck you said? Cover them up. Yeah, cover them up. from God. I like gifts. your shade, bro. But when did you become celibate? Two days or months. I think I've been celibate for like uh, two months now. Okay, so has it always yeah. been covering up? It's a gift <laughs> from God, bro. Now. Genuinely, bro. Has it been like that? Yeah, I mean, I always thought that way. Of course, I slip up and fuck a chick once in a while. Okay. But like, that's not, you know, I'm not perfect, I man. That. I never, I I'm not claiming that. to be perfect. I'm not claiming to be perfect. I don't think anybody should. So, so yeah, yeah, two yeah. weeks. Two months, man. Two months. Two weeks. Two, two months. I mean, two months. Okay. there are two men that months, do man. actually enjoy their women dressing in a certain way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, But I think that because those men, I don't know, like... What about their Call a confidence? Faggot. That's like, what you're how saying. How do you feel as She's a man? saying in girl language that he's a faggot because he wants you to go dress no. like that. No, no, no I mean, not man that wants but sexy. Some he just men doesn't care like to show. He, Hell no, bro. Yeah. he should care. If, if, if you're, you're, you're his girl. Well, I don't, I don't, you don't like, think that's insecurity. I do, I do both. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not, I don't always show my titties, but sometimes. You know what I mean? So it's not like I'm like every single day. Like, Yo, why you covering it? Yeah, no, I thought Rachel was covering it. Yeah, no, she's covering it. She knows how to take a knife. Just keep showing it. It's fine. That's good. I mean, okay. I'm not gonna put mine away. I don't care what people think. I just feel like I don't You shouldn't put yours away, right? You know, I wouldn't either. I don't know, but she's a mom, though. Like, I have a mom. My mom is not what she is. She's a mom. She's not mom. She's a milk man. How much pay for for those tits? Well, that was way back when, so yeah. like forty-five. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Forty-five. They look like, they look yeah, like water balloons. What the? <laughs> I went from A to D, and I, I'm proud of them. Why? I mean, they're my investments. Why not show them off? If I take a needle, would it go? No. No. <laughs> no. Oh, <laughs> Sorry. I wouldn't oh, put them away. The no. <laughs> At the end of the day, whether you're covered up or you're not covered up, people are gonna make assumptions and judgments on you. So might as well let them think anyway. I know who I am, so I don't care. But what there's anybody less thinking thinks. to do when you're letting them hang like that. When she's got her like sexual harasser right. trench coat on, I don't know. Like the mystery yeah. is attractive, you know? Right. What if the I, fuck you I'm got looking, in there? If I'm looking TNT. forward to meeting someone and I want to have some kind of special TNT. whatever, then okay, let me dress some type of way. But if not, I don't care. I also you know, want to say that. My apologies. No, no, go ahead. go ahead. I just want to say that as much as we want to, as humans, to feel like, oh, it makes a difference, bruh. Excuse me for saying this. Bruh. But, bruh, it, it, yeah, bruh. <laughs> it doesn't fucking make a difference. Bruh. It, does. it doesn't make it a does. difference. As it much as you does. think it, bruh. If you walk bruh. on the street, do, yeah, you, bruh. do you still get talked to on the street? Bruh. A hundred percent. Okay, so. Uh, wait, the uh -huh. approach that I receive, it's it different. might be slightly or it might be completely different I, than I a girl agree. that has all her titties out. Mm -hmm. Because a man sees me and he's like, she has nothing to show off for. Like, okay. she doesn't enough. care. I agree with that. So I they don't. come to me, they come I straight don't. to my face. So mm -hmm. I know they're talking to my face. Yeah. yeah, obviously, if I have a tight dress, they're going to see my curves. I'm not going to, like, always, like, wear baggy clothes mm -hmm. and go out like a homie. 